So now you've seen the overall structure of the course with its five units. What are things going to look like within a given unit? That's what we're going to explore in this series of videos. Y'all have identified as students that solving problems has been key to helping you learn physics in the past. And if we're going to spend class time doing that, then we must all come prepared to class to do so. Furthermore, there's a large variety of physics experience amongst you in this class. Some of you had Professor Bourgeois for Physics 1, some of you had Heath Hatch for Physics 1, and some of you had Physics 1 at some other institution. Due to this variation, we need to agree on what's going to be our starting point for class. And so as a consequence, the structure of this class will be as follows. Before class begins, you'll be expected to develop some base level understanding. You're not expected to gain complete mastery of the material, only a proficiency with basic ideas. This will be done through reading of a textbook and then some homework problems. These homework problems will prepare you for the in-class problems, which in turn prepare you for the exams. As such, as may be different from your prior experience, the homework in this class will not prepare you for the exams. It's not meant to. If we collectively want to solve the problems that we all admit are important to helping us learn physics, then we all need to come to class prepared, and that is the purpose that the homework serves. To ensure that everyone has achieved the requisite level of understanding necessary to do each class's activities, each class will begin with a quiz directly related to the homework. In the next section, we'll explore this pre-class uh, preparation in a little bit more detail. 